Welcome guys, Callum here and today I have another Minecraft version story for you guys and today I'll be showing you my mini school, mini school, uh, tree farm. And yes guys, I'm very, very sorry I have not been able to post any kind of like video. I've had loads of problems but now I'm recording with the ice mobile, the best quality, hopefully she'll be a lot better. Oh, so, <laughs> let's get started. So here it is guys. Guys, it's very compact. So yeah, so let's do that. So, so I'm gonna just get a so this farm only it only runs with oak saplings. So you would get your saplings. So you got the, so this chest here is your bone meal chest. There's an extra added one. So at the end of this I'll let you know next time. So you'll put your bone meal in here. So now you don't put that in there. You put your bone meal in here and then it flows down to the hoppers into the uh, thing on the rock. So there you go, it flows in and then there you go. So yeah guys, so uh, how this farm works, like you put your oak wood sapling down, you get bone meal automatically. And guys, with this, it's not as fancy as the other ones. So yeah, guys, the tree grows. It hasn't got. N it has not got a tree. A tree crusher, but it does the job. So when the tree grows, this piston pushes it. It activates this grud switch right there, but then pushes it away. And then you got you know a hole for your bone meal. So now you just use the left trigger and just keep on pumping and it. This thing does use a lot of bone meal. I mean, when I say a lot, a lot. It goes through a stack in like two harvesting harvest times. So yeah, this one is taking ages to grow. Um, yeah. So there we go. And when it gets up to this end, so when your wood grows. It goes along this this one torch and it all gets pushed out so that it will be in a nice block for you to get your iron axe and just destroy it all. So and here I brought it all open. So the yellow circuit is the bud switch. There you go. The white circuit is the pistons and uh, the red is the piston wheel. And here are the dimensions. So guys, so let's get So, uh, for this build, guys, you'll need. So, the dimensions for this build are quite slim. So, for this, you'll need a 5 by 3 spacing. And on this end, you'll have to go out one block. And it is the piston wall. And you'll have for the piston wall, you'll need a 2 by 8 spacing. So, yeah, guys. And you have to dig down one. Because you're you're gonna be standing, you're gonna be standing here. So yeah. So the materials for this build are. So yeah, the materials for this build are four. So here they are. So you will need forty-five pistons, one block of redstone, two sticky pistons, two redstone torches, one comparator. And go by the way, with a comparator, the repeaters. If I'll be you're just bringing like two more extra just in case. So you need eight repeaters just in, just in case. Around a stack of redstone, you probably won't need this stack. You'll probably need around forty something. One dispenser, one piece of dirt, and yeah, that being it. And hopefully I have not missed anything. So guys, so let's get started. So first of all, guys, you want to get your dirt and put this dirt here. So. So where you got the bit what sticks out, you want to put what sticks out up one and put the dirt here. So go up two, one, two, and go aside one and put the dirt there. So and now uh, so now you don't need your dirt sheet so let's get that away. So now I'm gonna get uh, do the pistons and that. So now you want to 
put a block here with a dispenser of spaces in like so. Then we put a block here with a sticky piston facing outwards and the other way they both want to be same thing. Then you want to put a block out here and go five pistons. So one, two, three, four. So one, two, three, four, five. And then you want to go three blocks. So one, two, three. And then you want to get your one horse slab. Maybe not one right now. So you get your one horse slab. Come up here and put that there. So it will stop the ginormous trees of growing so yeah so it won't break the farm and then guys here you want to put a block up like so and put five pistons so one two four four five there we go so there you go mainly all the pistons in place so now the budge works so you want to come up like so now for the budge to work so for the bud switch I want to use green wool, I mean green stained glass. So for the bud switch you'll want to put a block here with a piece of, a piece of redstone there. A block up, put a torch on it, yes, with a torch on it, a block up from there and a block from there. You want to put a 3 tick delayed repeater here. And you put a new block. Wait, one second. There we go. You want to put some redstone on here with a. Where did we go? Okay. With a. Uh, your last sticky piston here and a block there. So that's that done, guys. So. Now let's carry on with the bud switch. So now you want to put a block there, a block up like so, a block here with a repeat off there and a block up. So now your bud switch should be done. So when you put a block here, it should extend and when you push it away it should attack. There we go. So that's done now. Uh, now for the clock. So now for the clock you want to come down here with a uh, repeat off on one on set on one tick delay a comparator set on some um, a comparator set on subtract mode put and redstone going into it like so then so if I clear this cow off that cow so there we go so it's going to make a cow so if you do that cow then you want to put a piece of redstone here a repeater here set on one tick delay and a block there so there you go guys so now uh, when you put a block there your clock the clock should work and there you go guys so uh, now that is pretty much it guys so now uh, you want to now for the pistons so these are to hook up the pistons so now uh, I'm using white wool, I mean white stained clay. Uh, so you want to put a a repeat off here, set on one tick delay, a block there and a block there, redstone dust there and there. Then you want to come out of here. You want to put a block there, block there. Then you want to put two blocks for here and here. A repeat of there and a repeat of there, and then dust. So now guys, uh, when, so when you place it, your clock should work, and when you destroy it, both pistons should fire. So that's, this is all the main circuitry, like I said guys, it's tiny, for what it does. And yeah, now let's move on to the piston wall. So again guys, for the piston wall, so, it's 2 by 8, so 1, 2, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's a two by eight spacing. And guys, so now for the piston wall, you want to. So now you, this is what you want to make. You want to know. So this is where your flooring is going to be. So you want your pistons to go here. You want to put pistons like so. So then you want to just put pistons across. 
go across, leave one of that, and then it'll go quite high. So we want two, three, three, four, and five. So there we go, guys. And now, got that, so we should have this. Uh, so now, uh, you want to... I have this something else on, this is not right. So, uh, now you want to just bring out a block, put a block, so come out of one block, put a torch there. So the fish can, the fish, the wood is going to come along here and when it gets to the end, it can dig on this little thing on it. So now you want to come over here guys. Let me see if you want to put another block there. You want to put a... Whoops. My bad. I should not be using this. I should be using only... Enchant... Enchant... Sight. So, uh, you want to put a block here. So, two blocks. Like so. A piece of rope thing there. So, when you put a block there... It should activate it. I'm going to put a repeater there. So I've been put so many. Yeah. So now uh, you want to put blocks here. And here. And blocks there. And just put rope thing go all along these blocks. So you want to put a block up. Like so put stuff there and now is where your uh, slabs come in so put a slab there red thing and you just want to use slab and there we go right here another one to make sure the red thing just there so you want this block So, so there you go guys, so now if you put a block here, the fish can, it should work. So yeah guys, so now uh, a bit of an extra, if, so this thing uses a lot of bone meal. So if I were you guys, you would want to get some chest, a double chest, so you want to get a double chest, a double chest, so let me just bring the floor out so you want to uh, put it a block there up like so and put this thing so you want to put a block up there like so to a chest a double chest there and then uh, you want to get your hoppers So guys, so there you have it guys, so uh, I'm going to just fill it with bone meal, there you go, and guys this design got to me is not as fancy, it has not got loose crushes, but as you can see over here, uh, a dude with the care and you get the box from it, so yeah guys, so yeah. Let me just get this. And yes, guys, this only works for oak. So if you do any more of a tree and then oak, it will break it. So don't do it. So yeah, guys, let me just, let me just get some speed up the potion. So yeah, so you put, so you put down your sapling, get bow milled. And it grows. Put down your sapling. Suffering. It grows, and yeah, guys, and just go AFK, put something in the trigger or something. So, yeah, and you'll see how quickly it uses a bone meal. 
it is finished. But yeah, guys, if I will be here, I would have a uh, farm for you. Uh, some kind of like skeleton thing. Uh, here we go, guys. So there you go, guys. And yeah, guys, you have just built yourself a automatic. And there you go, guys, you get trappings as well. Mm, yeah. Let me just get to the end there. Maybe they've got another trapping. I'm probably going to be work, working on a advanced version with like a tree, a tree crusher and that. And yeah guys, so uh, this is pretty much it guys. Comment, rate and subscribe for more videos and tutorials like this guys. And yeah, I'm recording with my uh, ice mobile. But yeah guys, it's a good mic. I got it for quite cheap, it's normally around £70. I got it for like 39 I think. Ooh. So there we go, there we go, perfect timing, so there you go guys, and that will just go into a 12x12 block, so yeah guys, comment, rate, and subscribe for more videos by me, let me just put the screen in the background, there we are, comment, rate, and subscribe for more videos by me, and I will see you in the next video, goodbye. Yeah, guys. And then if you want you could put a hop test in that guys. So yeah guys it is pretty much it. Subscribe, comment and like and I will see you in the next video.